Hey, it's Greg Clay, I'm owner of Edge Body Boot Camp. I want to talk to you today about making the appropriate reaction when life happens. All right, we all know it. Uh, sometimes kids have sporting events. Sometimes traffic's crazy. Sometimes our flat tire happened. We forgot our lunch. Uh, we had to work overtime. Life happens, all right? Now, what really matters is how you react whenever life happens. So, I want to go over appropriate reactions and uh, share some of the not so great testimonies of some anonymous people that I've come across over the years. So, um, case study number one. I left my lunch at home. I had it prepped up, but I didn't bring it with me. So I went to McDonald's with the rest of my coworkers. That's a bad decision, all right? There's plenty of places out in uh, most cities across America that you can get something healthy and honestly, break it down into your macronutrients and organize it the way that you'd like to as well. So, I wanna share with you a couple of my go-tos. Uh, first would be any Chinese or Japanese um, hibachi grill, anywhere that has a teriyaki chicken with the rice and veggies. I go there, eat half the meal, make sure that I really eat most of the chicken they provide. It's probably about six ounces worth. And that's not a bad meal, you know. Most places you can walk out of there for 10 or $12. Uh, maybe a few extra bucks, but on a day that I forgot my lunch, I can spend a few extra bucks to keep on my fitness goals, keep my muscles pumped up, and keep my fat down, right? It's worth it. Another backup would be a Mexican restaurant or even one of the fast food places like Qdoba. Uh, you go in the line, and as long as you're not in that major lunch rush, you don't have to sit there for more than five minutes. You can get the rice, beans, chicken, stay away from the queso and the shredded cheese, but if you wanna do a little bit of guacamole and some of the salsas, that's a great option, you guys. All right, definitely beats fast food. It beats going out to Texas Roadhouse and, and getting the, the blooming onion beforehand and then getting a steak with a baked potato. We know that even though it's homemade, those restaurants are loading that stuff with fat. All right, so make the appropriate reaction there. All right, next thing is, I had to get right to my kids' baseball game. I hear it a million times, all right? Everybody's kids are involved. Uh, I know we're all trying to make sure that our kids are happy and we're on the go. Sometimes we don't have snacks available. Uh, sometimes we, we did and then we just left it at home again. Here's what I get all the time. Kids had a baseball game. I just, I had to eat a hot dog. I had to. And the nachos with the jalapenos and the soda, all right? Wrong. <laughs> appropriate thing to do is to hit a gas station beforehand you guys it's really easy to make the right reaction uh, in this scenario because you can get in and out of a gas station in two to three minutes y'all and every gas station that I've gone to in the past two or three years now has uh, a small selection of protein bars they got the the encore bars or the uh, metrics bars something like that and even if it has 400, 500 calories in the bar, just eat half of it. Hold you over until you can get home and eat something that's healthy for you, all right? Sacrifice a little bit. Maybe you have to not be all the way full right now and you can't stuff your face with a hot dog or nachos, but you're making the right decision. It's gonna pay off, all right? If you don't like the protein bars, uh, muscle milks are sold in almost every gas station across America. You can get, they have a, a protein smoothie out right now. It's like, they got a blueberry flavor, a strawberry banana flavor. Um, it's got 27 carbs, I think, 25 grams of protein, four and a half grams of fat. It is the perfect option if you're looking for a snack that's gonna hold you over and fuel your body to do something. Let's say that you're actually the baseball coach. Yeah, you do need some calories. That'd be an awesome option for you, okay? Now, if you're just going to sit in the stands and you just need some uh, protein to fuel your body, and you don't wanna add a whole lot of calories, the regular muscle milkshakes are great. They got 25 grams of protein, like six carbs, only a couple grams of fat. They're very lean. Uh, they got the bananas and cream flavor, vanilla bean, chocolate. It's all good, you guys, and it's not even my brand, and I'm still promoting it, all right? Because whenever life happens, these are the right reactions. There's always a go-to. What you need to figure out is what your personalized go-to is, all right? Those are a few of mine uh, over the next week, Try to come up with a few better options just in case something gets in the way. If you get stuck in traffic, you can just pull over in that gas station real quick, get you a quick little meal. All right, let's keep rocking it. Go Team Edge Body.